Yo, what's good everybody? It's Young John and today I'm going to teach y'all how to take a screenshot on your iPhone and have the screenshot take up the whole page in just one screenshot. So, I'm going to show y'all how to do it on Safari. So, let's say I type in NBA on Google and the first thing that comes up is all the games and the description on the about or whatever. Now, I'm going to go to the more standings just to show y'all. And you see that there's 15 teams in the East in this entire page. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to screenshot the page. See right there, screenshot. And then I'm going to tap the screenshot on the bottom left. And then look, I'm going to tap where it says full page at the top of the screen. You see where it says screen and then full page to the right of it? You're going to press where it says full page. Screen, full page. And look at that. That's zooming out. And then you're going to hit done. Because you can scribble on the picture. Once you hit done, you're going to hit save PDF to files. And it's going to ask you if you want to name it. And the name it, you just tap on where it says MBA dash Google search. And then you erase it. So I'm erasing it. And I'm just going to type it in MBA Eastern standings. And then I'm going to hit done in the top right. And I'm going to hit save in the top right corner in blue. And then it's done. So now I'm going to go back to my home page. And I'm going to tap where it says files. And everybody's iPhone comes with files by default. So you just need to find where your files are. And then look for it. And where it says NBA Eastern Standings. That's what I just named it. I tap on it. And look. I'm scrolling down. And it's all on one screenshot. Not multiple. Just one. And if you find this information helpful, make sure to hit this video with a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you have it. I appreciate it. And I'm going to show you all how to do it again with a different website or a different example. So if you're into cryptocurrency, you know, coinmarketcap.com, it shows you the list of all the cryptos in order of like the, their total market cap. With Bitcoin being number one. And then look. On the first page. There's a hundred different cryptos. On a, hun a hundred page. A hundred different cryptos on the first page. I'm going to screenshot it. I'm going to tap on the right where it says full page. I can zoom out to show you. And then when I'm done looking at it. I'm just going to hit where it says done and save PDF to files. Then I'm going to hit save. I'm going to rename it to coin market cap top 100 list. Okay. Hit done. Hit save in the top right corner. Then I'm going to go back to my home screen. Tap on files again to open up the files. There it is, the first one, coin market cap list. And look at that. All 100 of the top crypto, all screenshotted on one page. Just one screenshot. And you don't have to, like, enable any fancy settings or... It just comes default and it should work on your iPhone. Try it out. And I'm going to show y'all that it doesn't work on every application. So I'm in the settings. I took a screenshot of my settings. And you see that there's not a view full page or save as full page. It's just a regular screenshot. No! So I'm just going to delete that. I don't need that. And that's the video, y'all. If y'all found this video helpful... Make sure to hit it with a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank y'all for watching. I'm out. Peace.